All right, good afternoon, people. Okay, so today we are. Okay, today we are at Funan. Okay, earlier it was Plaza Singh. Today we are at Funan. Okay, receive an email from Funan, and they actually issue a challenge to me. So it's to tackle three restaurants. So today there will be three food challenges. Okay, I'm not sure about the volume yet. Mervin has all the detail. We're waiting for him to arrive. Uh, we are actually at one of the restaurants. This is one of the restaurants that we will be tackling because this is at the level one. So this is why we are here first to film an intro. And it's like very bright here. So this is why we are here to film, film the intro and then gonna figure out which, which, which restaurant to tackle first. As per the PS video, the Plaza Sing one, some of you guys are actually asking me to film another video at a mall. And we, we decided to go ahead with Funan because I think when this mall first opened, a lot of you guys actually uh, asked me to film here, but the thing is, we don't have the permission. And every time I film something here, we get chased off. Okay, so today we got permission. And yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna see what happens. We're gonna see what sort of challenge we have. And let's see how it goes. All right, first stop. We are at Ba Wang Cha Ji. Okay? Mm -hmm. Ba Wang Cha Initially, when I heard the Ji, right, I thought it's the chicken, but it's huh? not. Okay, this Ji is like the, the dancing, the, the Ji. Okay, anyways, uh, we're here. Okay, I got a drink, huh? my drink is coming, so I remove my mask. This is, we, we're here to pick up the drinks first, because uh, part of the challenge is to actually complete whatever drinks that they actually issue to me while finishing what we will be eating in the rest of the restaurants. We got three restaurants. One is Kebab Factory. One is the place that we do the intro, which is Butter Bean. All right, so the last one is Fonkitsu Cousin, which is this volcano ramen place at the basement. Three food challenges. Uh, the criteria is to actually use their drinks while I'm bashing through all the rest of the challenges. Okay, so uh, we're gonna, we, we can pick up the drinks and we're gonna go to the first stop, which is Kebab Factory, okay. We'll see you guys when the drinks are here. So uh, maybe like Forever Spring Oolong is the is the the one that the one that is really light. Like. Milk tea. It's okay. We can take one milk tea also. Okay. Can can I do two two of these lots for you first? Thank you very much. Okay. A few moments later. Awesome. One is this is the milk tea. Can drink full latte. Can drink full latte. Forever Spring Oolong fresh milk. Okay. 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 Right. Yeah. Okay. So we got the drinks. Okay. We need to finish a total of three cups of their tea, okay? So we, we're gonna bring this to, well, to to bring it to go while we are attempting all the challenges. Okay, this is the Forever Spring. Forever Spring Oolong. Oolong. Okay, Forever Spring Oolong. And this is the Tangerine Pua. Tangerine Pua. Okay. Pua latte. So this one got milk in it, it's something like a milk tea kind of thing. Uh, yeah, we, I'm quite excited. I actually take a sip of both. Both is very nice. Uh, we're gonna bring this to uh, kebab factory now. We're gonna destroy some kebabs with the tea. Okay, let's go. Ah, yao kong, yao kong. Parisa mayo and garlic. Round one. All right, so uh, first stop, kebab factory. We got two. Okay, these are called gyros. Okay, Mervin say it's not pronounced as. I initially pronounced them as gyros, but Mervin say it's pronounced as gyros. Okay, so whatever. It's not the same. Oh, whatever. Okay, so gyros. We give this uh, pita bread with French fries with uh, meat in there. Uh, we added garlic mayo and harissa mayo, right? Yeah, garlic mayo and harissa mayo. Garlic sauce and harissa mayo. Okay, uh, this two is packed, okay? Uh, we weigh them out. One of this is above 500 grams, easily. Okay, this one is a little bit smaller. These are the kebabs. Okay, the kebabs are 450 grams, about a pound. And then, uh, yeah, about a pound. And then, um, I think we're with chicken. So this, uh, this lamb, chicken, chicken. Okay, so uh, we're gonna we're gonna try and finish this pasta. It's only the first stop. 
And then we got now two more restaurants to destroy. So I'm gonna open this up and let's get started. Okay, I'm gonna dial all this with the Forever Spring Oolong Tea. It's like, it looks like green tea, like it's green in color. And it's very light, very refreshing. Okay, let's get started. Let's get started. Let's get started. Okay, Mervin, give me a count up. Alright, so first up, we are at Kebab's Factory. So we got one chicken gyro, one lamb gyro, and one chicken shawarma uh, kebab roll. Alright, so for the chicken shawarma kebab rolls, they are actually loaded with a bunch of meats and vegetables and you can actually uh, mix and match what vegetables you want to put in there. I actually add on uh, that harissa mayonnaise inside and it's very, very tasty. All right, next up, gyros. Okay, so gyros is actually, for those that are not very familiar with what is gyros, uh, it's Greek pita bread uh, with a bunch of vegetables, tomatoes, onions. Uh, then you can choose whether you want chicken or lamb. Uh, I got both chicken and lamb. Uh, personally, I like the lamb a lot more because the lamb is so, so flavorful. Oh, those things are huge! <laughs> it's a technique, the technique is to get the fries out of it. Okay, so I thought that the portion size is actually really big and I, uh, I will definitely come back here because of the fact that uh, it's really healthy. It's a good way to get in your vegetables intake. If you're eating something healthy, if you're trying to you know, watch your calories, eating something healthy and trying to get your protein and vegetables in, this is the place to go. Alright, so uh, I forgot to mention the time limit earlier. Yeah, the, the challenge is to finish three of this in five minutes. Okay, uh, we, we got it well under five minutes, under which is four. yeah, under four minutes, which is okay. So now we're gonna move on to butter bean for the second challenge. Uh. The tea is delicious. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Marie wants to say the tea is delicious, and I agree, okay, this tea is extremely refreshing. It's oolong though, but it tastes like green tea. Okay, but uh, yeah, moving on to the next location now. You know what I got this time? <laughs> Round two. All right, so we have butter bean now. Okay, I've got three of their iconic sandwiches. It's the chicken one, the fish one, and the ham and cheese, and then three of their toasts. Okay, the peanut butter and jelly, the kaya, and this one is actually the say cheese. Okay, the menu is just that say cheese. Okay, uh, initially we wanted something else, but we went ahead with this because that one might take up too much space in my stomach. Okay. I'm very full from the first, actually the first one, the um, kebab factory, I'm already like feeling something already. So this one, and then I, we still got a two kilo ramen at the end. Okay, so uh, for this one, we're actually using their in-house drink, the lychee orange tea. Okay, a lot of tea to drink today. Okay, let's get started. Okay, I'm just gonna start with the chicken one first. <laughs> it's very messy. Yeah, whatever. Okay, let's go. Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one, go. All right, next up, butter bean. Okay, we really like this place, especially the interior. It's very nice and bright. Uh, and okay, we. I'm actually eating a lot of bread for this one. Uh, toast with sandwiches. Uh, okay. I, I thought that this is not gonna be easy because of the fact that. Uh, you know, usually for toast it's hard to get out fast, but this one is really very fluffy. I don't know how to do it, but their toast is extremely fluffy. Oh, it's drink. I don't even need much water. I could just put everything. I just I could just dial everything really quick. <laughs> I'm taking too long. Too big, yeah. Strawberry. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, my jam. 
<laughs> oh, fun fact, fun fact. I doubt seven of this in a minute before. This cut is fresh. Say cheese. Okay, I really want to say the sandwiches and the toast, they're amazing. The bread is so soft. Like, you know, usually when I eat toast, sometimes when I eat too fast, the, the edges sort of cut my the inside of my mouth. But this one, no, it, it, I don't know, it's just so soft. I don't know how to do it. The bread is extremely soft. Uh, the sandwiches are very, very good. I like the, the chicken one, the fried chicken one, especially because that one, it's got this, uh, it reminds me of like Japanese curry. They added the curry sauce and then uh, with the chicken, everything just comes together very nicely. Yeah. Okay, so second challenge down under five minutes. Now we're gonna move on to the last one. The last, uh, the one, no, we got actually two more, but second last one. Okay, so we're gonna move on to the ramen now. Okay, see you guys there. After this, okay, this is the second last challenge. Uh, the last challenge is actually another cup of tea from Ba Wang Cha Chi. So uh, this is the last food challenge, I would say. Okay, uh, this is according to them is two kilos of ramen, uh, broth, everything combined. Okay, this thing is two kilos. Uh, there's bean sprouts. There is a mountain of uh, beef right here. There's char siu, more char siu, uh, eggs, seaweed, which reminds me of that. Ichiran. <laughs> okay, uh, and a bowl of rice right here. Okay, uh, it's part of this, so I have to doubt everything. Okay, so uh, last food challenge. Uh, the first two challenge I took less than five minutes, so uh, we still got a little over twenty minutes to doubt this one. Okay, so last food challenge. Let's finish strong. I have to finish this one as well. This is uh, this is the tangerine pua latte from Pang Cha Chi. Okay. Let's 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 do this. Okay, let's Three, go. two, one, go. Oh, Alright, so uh third stop we are at Tonkutsu Kazat, this ramen place. Okay guys, I'm sure you can see the steamer. Okay, I really like their concept because they have this uh they serve the ramen in this like uh, stone kind of thing and it, it keeps your ramen hot 
throughout your entire meal. You guys, the, the, the challenge with this one, it's not just capacity, but it's, it's also the physical temperature. Okay, so it's like a double-edged sword for me because uh, one thing is I'm trying to eat fast, but the second thing is because of the food, because of the fact that the food is hot, nice and hot, I get to enjoy the food. So uh, very, very tasty. Uh, I like the that shabu shabu beef on top, very nice. Uh, and yeah, the, a lot of vegetables in there. Like the ratio, I really like the ratio. There is a good amount of vegetables in there, a good amount of protein in there, and a good amount of uh, uh, not overly like you know the the carbs wise. It's not too much noodle, so it's just nice. The ratio is perfect. Round four. All right, so uh, we're down to the last item. Okay, I still got, I think, about five minutes left, so I can enjoy this one. Okay, so this is uh, it's called a duck mountain. There is uh, okay, this is charcoal whipped cream, and then inside is some sort of I think it's pura tea, right? Pura, yeah, pura tea, Ten tenderine pura tea inside. Okay, you can you can customize the sugar level however you want. I got like I think 30% only because I don't want I don't want more like sugar. I don't want more e extra like sugar already. Okay, so last drink of the day. Let's enjoy this. I don't know how you how you should actually like no like drink this. You just mix it in or you don't eat this thing first. Wait, eat this one then. I got enjoy too much. Eh? Oh, but this drink is very delicious. I will come back and order this. Eh? Okay. All right. So uh, we're done with the, uh, this. Still got a bit. <laughs> this is very nice. Okay. Ma Wen Cha Si. They are. Dark Mountain. Okay, Mervin gonna order one more cup also because it's, really, it's, just, that good. it's just that good. Okay, it's <laughs> really the, that whipped cream though is something else. That whipped cream, I don't know how to do it, but it's not sweet. It's extremely creamy. I'm gonna put this cup in front of me. No, you gotta save this. This ambassador come and scold me again. <laughs> okay, uh, it's it's sweet. Uh, and then they put some sort of like peanuts or I don't know some sort of nuts on top. It's extremely like. That thing is salty, so it balances everything very nicely. Like, it's just so good. Like, I, I got nothing to. Okay, anyways, uh, that's it. We're done with the challenge. Okay, all three, uh, all. Total of four challenges, okay? There's total of four challenge. The first one, I went to Kebab Factory. We did it in uh, just under four minutes. The second challenge, we did it in around four minutes or so. The one at Butter Bean. Uh, and then we go to the ramen. The ramen really, uh, the ramen was tough because of the physical temperature of the dish. Uh, and then the final one, which is this uh, dessert-like drink from Bawang Cha Chi. Okay, uh, so all in all, I really had fun today at Munan. I really, really had fun. Uh, it was, I like this mall a lot because of the fact that this mall is very hip. It's very like <laughs> hype, right? Very hype, like, like very, very nice interior and everything. Okay, uh, and you guys asked for it. You guys wanted to see me do something at Funan. Uh, this is why I'm here. Okay, uh, I will be doing another mock. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Do pop by to Funan and try out all the, all the food that I've enjoyed. I personally really, the one that really surprised me today is butter bean. Okay, they are toast. Oh, so soft. Okay, <laughs> that's it. That's it for this video. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.